get you the latest update as far as Defence Minister Rajnath Singh is concerned, who currently is in Ladakh. Remember, he is on a three-day visit to Ladakh. Yesterday, he inaugurated certain infra projects as well. And he also sent a clear message to China, uh, saying that India is not going to succumb before its military pressure and will hit back if needed. Raksha Mantri Rajnath Singh also said that Indian Army is capable of giving a befitting reply if threatened. Now, his statement comes at a time when Indian Army has redirected at least 50,000 additional troops to its border with China to the line of actual control. The move is now being considered as historic shift towards an offensive military posture against the world's uh, second biggest economy. That is the breaking update that we have at this point in time. So a clear message has gone from China even as the dialogue process is still going on between India and China over the de-escalation at the key issues uh, along the line of actual control. Mohit Sharma joining us on the broadcast more on this. Mohit, an important message there by the Defence Minister for China. Well, absolutely. You know, and this is something that was much expected as well uh, from, uh, you know, this three-day visit which was undertaken by the Raksha Mantri himself. And uh, more importantly, you know, if you look at the, the overall activities which was uh, taken into account by the Raksha Mantri, it was very clear that uh, India was uh, once again, you know, checking the preparedness, the readiness of its armed forces. Uh, yesterday is, as well, you know, if you remember, 11 of uh, key um, key bridges and uh, roads were also inaugurated in Ladakh itself by the Raksha Mantri to ensure that, you know, the connectivity in, in, in Ladakh area from the far-fetched area is well maintained and uh, there is absolutely no issues in mobility for the Indian Armed Forces. Now, this particular statement that has now come out from the Raksha Mantri is very clear that uh, India will protect uh, its, its sovereignty, its integrity, and more importantly, we will do anything to ensure that our territories remain ours. And uh, it's a very direct message to China there. And, and uh, remember, you know, all of this comes amidst the de uh, the escalation process which has been underway. It has been almost uh, 14, uh, 14 months since, uh, you know, this entire stir between India and China started. And... Uh, Despite the fact that you know India has been uh, India has been asking uh, not just China directly but also several, through various other countries who have also you know successfully asked China to uh, to de-escalate from the matter, it seems that the entire process has been a rather slow one. And I miss this 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 message is a very direct one from the Raksha Mantri that India will do anything to in to protect its own sovereignty. Back in the studio here now. All right. Thank you very much, uh, Mohit, for the moment, for joining us with all of those details. Let's now listen in to what exactly Defence Minister Rajnath Singh had to say. The whole world is our family. Here Sunday is the only one. But the Shah Manisha has given us Sunday. We are the Vishw Santi. हम केवल अपने ही देश में शांति चाहने वालों लोगों में नहीं रहे हैं, बल्कि विश्व शांति के हम पुजारी रहे हैं। हमारे यहाँ तक परंपरा है कह रही है कि हम सफल भी धारण करते हैं, तो शांति की स्थापना के लिए सफल धारण करते हैं। यह हमारे यहाँ परंपरा रही है। किसी पर आक्रमण करने के लिए नहीं। हमारा यह उद्देश भारत के इतिहास के पन्नों को पलट कर कोई देखे भारत ने आज तक दुनिया के किसी देश पर न तो कभी आक्रमण किया है और दुनिया के किसी एक देश की एक इंच जमीन पर भारत ने कब्जा किया यह भारत का चरित्र हमारी मंशा पूरी तरह से साफ है लेकिन है पड़ोसियों के साथ कभी कभी ठन जाती है पड़ोसियों के भी सोचना पड़ेगा सदियों से हम पड़ोसी हैं सदियों तक हम पड़ोसी रहेंगे क्या जिन मुद्दों को लेकर विवाद है उसका कोई अस्थाई समाधान नहीं निकाला जा सकता बातचीत के द्वारा अस्थाई समाधान नहीं निकल सकता हम पड़ोसी थे पड़ोसी हैं और पड़ोसी रहेंगे मैं सारे पड़ोसियों की बात मैं बात कर रहा हूं क्यों नहीं बातचीत के जरिए समाधान निकाला जा सकता मनसा साफ चाहिए
लेकिन मैंने भाई कोई यह सोचे हम किसी को आंख दिखा के डरा देंगे मुझे अपने सेना किशोर और पराक्रम का विश्वास है आंख दिखाने वालों को माकूल जवाब देने की कुबत भी हमारे देश की सेना के जवानों के अंदर हम न किसी को आंख दिखाना चाहते हैं न किसी का आंख दिखाना हमें मंजूर है